big oil and petrol bankers. Will Biden's lunacy invoke Mexico's fifth rail inside the United States? The Biden administration has already caused a huge uproar with Mexico after the United States State Department published negative views on Mexico's human rights, especially following the deaths of a number of American citizens in Mexico. These killings occurred over the last few months. The international merchant bankers are taking a huge hit as countries are de-dollarizing, decoupling from the petrol dollar. Now Biden threatens Mexico with act now or else. Concerning the privatization of Mexico's oil and gas industry, this would allow America's Chevron, Marathon Petroleum, and other U.S. oil and gas corporations to exploit Mexico's oil and gas as well as other resources. In 2021, Marathon Oil imported 9 million barrels of Russian oil. Chevron imported 4 million barrels of Russian oil. Clearly, both companies are using the Biden administration in an attempt to make up for their losses as a result of Biden's destructive sanctions against Russia. This is another example of the boomerang effect that I indicated a year ago would occur upon the United States. Mexico has wisely refused to privatize government-owned oil and gas giant Pemex and the CFE utility company in Africa and countries around the world when state-owned natural resource companies are privatized and laws permit Western investors, it hurts the citizens of those countries. Almost always with rising prices, Mexico's Obrador administration is not likely to give in to the Biden administration's threats of raising trade tariffs. Mexico has had a trade surplus with the United States for several decades, and that is not likely to change. However, it could cause hardship on many American consumers who buy goods manufactured in Mexico. There are tens of millions of Mexicans residing in the United States who rely on products made in Mexico. Some are consumers and others are businesses. Threatening a trade war with Mexico will not bode well for the United States any more than the ongoing trade war with China. It will aid in sending inflation even higher and in a worst case scenario could even invoke violence by Mexico's fifth rail within the United States, which involves a dramatic increase in violent actions by drug cartels and its affiliates.